It's Red Carpet Diary at the Toronto International Film Festival. Hip-hop Snoop Dogg went to Jamaica to make a new album. He came back as reggae artist Snoop Lion. The documentary Reincarnated traces his journey from Compton to consciousness. My life is in stages, you know what I mean? We the jury in above entitled action find a defendant, Calvin Brodus, not guilty of the crime of murder in the first degree. Whether it's me performing live on stage. Let me hear you say Snoop Dogg! Snoop Dogg! Or me going through stages in life. That's what my life has always been based on. It was it was just a roller coaster because a lot of the stuff that I seen on screen really touched my emotions, so it's kind of hard for me to watch it. It's been through a lot, that guy, and I think people have forgotten that, what Snoop has been through, and he's always been a very honest artist, and he's always, but maybe he's certain things he hasn't talked about, he talks about them in this movie. Snoop Dogg is still in Jamaica, observing and participating in authentic Jamaican culture. Oh, the body guy's on with I don't think I ever left rap. I think I just elevated into this reggae music, and as a reggae artist, I'll always be able to go back and, you know, dibble and dabble into the music that feels good to me. Finishing it was great, making it was great, meeting all the different people along the way. It was like two yellings in the whole making of the film, which is like pretty crazy. What was the biggest thing you learned about yourself through this experience? Um, I don't even think I learned anything about me, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm so busy doing me, I don't get a chance to look at me and see what, you know, what I learned from me today. I didn't just want to come here and say I made a record in Jamaica and grew some dreadlocks. Rastafari called me. And if you hear me, come and join the revolution.